present for Bay Gone Wrong. Hey. Hey. Mm-hmm. Present for you. What? I hope that's not wet. Yeah. <laughs> Because of the rain. <laughs> what the fuck? It's a what the hell? <laughs> Just oh my god! You look scary. No. <laughs> yeah, it's the Joker. You just scared me. Like I just saw this part. Yeah. And fuck, I I thought you're trying to scare me. <laughs> and it looks scary. What's this? It's a comic. Really? It's what a part a good amount of Suicide Squad was based on. The Joker and Harley parts. Is this? Oh, hey. Like, wait, hold on, like... Yeah, yeah, right here, see? She's not wearing anything? Damn. No, it's just a... Like, right here. Like, the dancing part? Mm. Like, that was, like, the club scene, basically. Ah. And then he kills someone in the club scene, like that. And then there's another scene, also, where Joker's all fucked up on drugs and shit. Um, where is it? Here. I don't know. I don't know where it is. But it's a really good scene, but it's not around here. Alright, you don't wanna end it though. You don't you don't wanna hey. 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 You're welcome. Some number Oh, my wiener. You're watching the Weekly Wednesday What's Up, the section of my channel where I tell you everything that's happened to me in one week. Uh, today, I think I'm going to do voice, uh, generally because, um, I don't know, I feel like I think a little bit better, and I have noticed, I sort of get into this one pattern of reacting or recording a lot of videos on Wednesday, because it's my day off on Wednesday, and then by the time everything is said and done, I end up recording uh, something for the weekly Wednesday, what's up? But then I come off really tired at that particular moment because, you know, deadlines and other things like that. So I figured this time around, let me go ahead and do it while I'm walking on the streets of Japan. And I always tend to have a little bit of a clearer mind when I'm talking and just speaking to you guys one-on-one, -on -one, things like that, a little less tired, I think. That is our prime focus nowadays. Just a little less tired, a little less frustrated. Breathe in, breathe out, release the anger, rage, and frustration. And I'm sure you could probably imagine that's a lot of what these last couple of weeks have always been about, have always been about the, the venting on the weekly Wednesday, what's up? And, you know, I'm doing my best to identify those issues, identify those problems, and not really letting people get off scot-free and such, uh, making videos about me or whatever the case may be, but essentially trying to learn the form of forgiveness, I suppose. I've been watching a lot of videos on letting go of grudges, you know, letting, uh, not expecting forgiveness or apologies from people that have done you wrong, things like that. So I'm doing my best to deal with that particular situation. But anyways, moving on, I just finished recording a lot of cool videos with uh, Dante. Uh, 
most famous black man in Japan, and we had a lot of fun. It was a uh, Dante Carver, just for clarification. <laughs> and we actually did Civil War, the full reaction to Civil War, and it was a great, great time had by all that were in the live stream. I was a little worried because it was in the middle of the day for me, so it was going to be really late for the rest of everybody else. And so I wasn't really sure if people were going to attend, but it was actually, honestly, it was actually one of my highest watched uh, videos. It was like around uh, 125 something people that were watching at that time. I'm sure if I tried pulling it off earlier in the morning, maybe it would be a little more successful. I don't know. It's, it's a very tricky one, I think. And of course, Civil War is a really big one, so it was... Uh, it got a lot of views being pulled in. The only problem is, and I had talked to one of my uh, other reactor friends about this because it's Marvel, so we thought copyright was going to be cool and such. But, um, and because usually they always play the audio, and usually I wear headphones, but when I'm reacting with two people, it's a little more difficult to have more than one headphone and such. Um, so, I wanted to go ahead and try it without the headphones and play the audio through the speaker. And unfortunately, as I would have expected, it got flagged almost immediately by Disney. So now I'm in the middle of disputing these two minutes in a three hour something stream. <laughs> I'm disputing these two, three minutes and hopefully Disney will let up on it. Uh, it's something that I've talked with Adam about from Superhero News because, you know, they were able to do it. And he said it got cleared up or so within a week. I hope it does because it was a fairly damn good discussion. And I'm actually very proud of everybody that was in the comments, pitching in, show, explaining their ideas. And it, the thing that I really loved about this, and this is one of the main reasons I do what I do in terms of reactions, is the fact that when I react and when I get into it, when I get into that zone and I start having debates, especially with Dante by my side, uh, the fans, the, the viewers watching also got into it. And that's what, that's the thing I love so much. And I, that's the one thing I really try to explain. And I don't always explain it myself so clearly, but that's the one thing I love so much and appreciate so much about how original reactions sort of began of just this feeling, this unanimous fan feeling of a certain scene. Like, for example, when, um, when uh, uh, oh, a certain character in Civil War uh, passes and such, and there's a funeral scene, and they make a speech. I was talking about how I actually really tear up at this scene, and someone in the comments was like, dude, I know how you feel, Akasan. Uh, I've never told anybody, but I feel the same way, and I tear up at this scene as well. And I'm like, yes, that's exactly why I'm here, and that's what I do what I do. But anyways, it was a really good feeling to have, and everybody was arguing about who was right, who was wrong in terms of civil war, and I don't know, I really enjoyed this, and that's my main focus. That's the thing, those are the things I think of when I'm at my worst moments, and you know, I'm getting fucking blamed for uh, content stealing or whatever, you know, be, always being put on that side. These are the things I'm always trying to remember is this is why I need, this is why I do what I do, and this is why I want to keep doing it because of fans like this. And because of the feeling that we can unanimously have at the same time. So let me figure out what's going on with that. I got a great, uh, we did a few interviews last week. I'm starting a new segment, as I promised you before. I'm starting a new segment and you guys will be seeing it hopefully within the next day or so. And I really hope you guys enjoy it because it's one of my promises that I promised you I'd be keeping about keeping in tune with my life in Japan and my lifestyle in Japan and sharing that with the rest of you guys. That's what my channel was here for and that's what I promised you that I would do. Not just reactions, but 
getting a little more strict on showcasing the other stuff that I sporadically used to put up on the channel. For me, it seemed like I was putting it up a little more often, but I understand. I understand the image that people were getting of my channel uh, just being only a reaction channel. But I definitely want to give a big shout out to the rest of you guys out there within the last week or so. I think it's been about a week now. Of those of you, all of you guys out there that have really been out there like defending the channel and every time I put out a video, and you're going to get a lot of haters, so obviously, a lot of uh, unfortunately misinformed viewers and usually, usually, I don't want to say children, but young, usually young, you know, I would, I'm going to assume young adults and such that are unfortunately very misinformed, but I really want to take the time to just thank all of each and every one of you guys that take the time to correct those when I'm not around to correct them, to really try and help show them, explain to them like, yo, this channel has been doing these type of videos for a long time. You just haven't been motherfucking paying attention. And I really appreciate that within the last couple of weeks or in, within the last week, I've been uploading a lot of good old stuff, preparing you guys for the new stuff coming up. Uh, I just really appreciate the fact that what you guys have done in helping this Red Dread Nation become stronger than ever. If anything, through all these sort of accusations and being thrown under buses or what have you not, and also being put at fault for my own faults, obviously, admittedly, I appreciate you guys sticking with me and it really shows me just how strong this Red Dread Nation rolls. Got a lot of other new stuff coming up very soon. Tomorrow I'm uh, doing another interview with a bunch of women are coming to the studio and that's for another segment that will probably roll out in the near future but not relatively soon. The YouTube space as well is um, I was going to book it for tomorrow but I realized that I probably can't bring alcohol into the YouTube space. Thus, we decided it's better to have all the ladies getting drunk at the Red Dreaded Studios instead. Then, moving on, uh, there's a lot of, uh, there's a few promotional things coming up, and um, I don't want to, I guess I shouldn't really say too much, but if you're really interested in virtual reality, I guess we'll just put it that way. If you're interested in virtual reality, there's another segment coming up that this one company is has been trying, really, really trying hard to put me in touch with. And uh, we're going to do a show, or I guess a little feature for their channel or something like that. I will try to keep you guys updated on that one as much as possible. But there's a lot of big things coming up, guys, like I said. And of course, of course, we have Flash coming up, The Walking Dead coming up. There's so much good stuff right now in terms of reactions. I just really feel this is the direction we need to go. Focus on the core things, the, the main reasons people tune in to the channel. Focus on those, strength, strengthen them up a bit. Keep on doing the thing, the legal things, right? Keep on doing things very legal and honorable and such. And then just really make sure I don't get lazy on all the other stuff that just takes a little bit of extra work and such. I really have been enjoying somewhat of a mini break here. Mini break um, in terms of not really rushing to just render reaction after reaction after reaction after reaction and I think it's actually been good for myself for my channel just to have that kind of breather my best friend is coming to Japan in the next day or so and I'll be showing him around Japan it's something I used to do in the past but I'm looking forward to showing him around as well. Uh, he'll be here in Tokyo for five days, so I have a few ideas of places where I want to take him, but at the same time, I think I might also do uh, something called a power hour. And that's essentially where you take a shot every minute, uh, a, a shot of beer or whatever every minute uh, for one hour. And it doesn't seem like a lot, but it's, it's a lot. Oh shit, and I just realized I need to 
go buy some shot glasses or something like that. And hopefully I'm planning to live stream it with you guys. So uh, if you're available, I'll try to set the time and it should be some fun stuff. All right, let's wrap it up here with this weekly Wednesday What's Up. I think that's enough for what's going on now. I am doing good. I'm feeling healthy. I'm feeling very positive about the future and what's to come. Thank you guys for sticking with me. Like, share, subscribe, and all that other good stuff. And I will let you guys know what's up next week. Peace, guys.